Hey, I just want to talk about quickly one thing that a lot of people don't know. You can actually scrap gold-filled jewelry. And um, gold-filled jewelry will usually say something like uh, 12 carat 120th GF. Or, or sometimes it says uh, 10 carat or 14 carat 120th GF uh, on, on the side of it and stuff like that. And um, what I have here is like three bags. Uh, this is stuff we, we had and we just separated recently. This is uh, what I have that's 10 karat gold filled. Uh, this is 12. And there's a lot here. And uh, what's in this bag is 14 karat gold filled. And uh, from my understanding, um, gold filled jewelry roughly scraps at about the same price as um, sterling silver would scrap, uh, and that's right now. I mean, if gold goes up, that'll change. Um, and the, and this is what people told me. But also, I went on eBay and I, I looked at some completed auctions for, uh, for gold-filled jewelry um, in the 12 carat range. And what was, what I was finding was that um, I was finding that that it would sell for a certain amount, and then and it was selling grams. So then I converted that grams to I converted the grams to ounces, and I I divided the the total amount by what was, um, what they had listed, um, at, at, by the weight, and then I just divided it by, like, uh, the amount that it sold for, it for, and then I got a, a rough idea what it was selling per ounce, is, which I understand better, and it seemed to be selling between 22 and $28 per ounce, which is about what silver scraps uh, had. Um, so anyway, this is a pretty heavy bag of, um, 12 karat gold fill, and, um, there's, say, say this scraps would say $20 an ounce, and there's about two pounds here, right? And I'm just going to throw it on. I got a scale here, and uh, you can probably read the numbers, so you could see. Uh, okay, actually it's about one pound, 14 ounces, right? And then there's some stones and stuff in there, so I, I guess I'll do it one more time just to make double certain. Okay, about one pound, uh, 14 ounces, right? So that would be, let's see, 30 ounces, right? So in this little this bag here, and that's not counting the value of if some of it's nice or good looking or sellable for, for just being jewelry, right? There should be about $600. I mean, subtract the stones, uh, something like that. Let's say if, if I could get $20 an ounce for this, um, there would be $600 in this bag right here. And I mean, a lot of people just, just wouldn't realize that.